Good day, Will England with Sprint Product Ambassadors. Same quiet space here at the Sprint campus. We're checking out the SIM card, or lack of, on the Google Pixel. Uh, it comes with an eSIM, and if you're going to use it on Sprint, turn it on. It will activate automatically using the eSIM tool, and you should even be able to swap devices with it. If not, you can jump on Sprint.com and do a swap quite easily, clicking the Activate button once you're logged in. Use the included SIM tool or any SIM tool you have laying around. Give it a push and you find a SIM tray that, as you zoom in, it will not focus that close. It says Google on the inside, but there's no SIM included. The SIM tray is there for if you do pay off the phone, unlock the phone, and want to take it to another carrier, you can. Uh, you'll notice one other thing's missing from the SIM tray. There's no memory card slot. The 64 gigabyte storage on the phone is what you got. Uh, Google is counting on you to use their free, unlimited photo storage to keep all your pictures in Google Photos, and all your videos in Google Photos, or on YouTube. We'll see how that works with some of the larger apps and games. But 64 gigabytes should be good for now. You can buy larger models for more expensive prices. Marketing has supplied us with the 64 gig model uh, just for demo purposes. So that's what's inside the SIM tray on the Google Pixel 4 XL.